Mason opening day, NBAA 2014. It's been a very interesting year for the industry, especially for the light jet segment. Yeah, uh, <laughs> the best and worst. What's happening out there with light jets? Well, you know, the light jet market is uh, is incrementally improving. It uh, has been since 2009. I think we're starting to see the improvement happen, but it's not exponentially improving by any means. We like the direction of the global markets. We like the direction of the U.S. markets, and then we like the direction that our business is going. What kind of year has this been for Eclipse overall from the standpoint of the company and then with the airplane? The 550 got certified on March 28th this year. So uh, we've had three quarters of production, which is great. We're transitioning from a, call it an MRO facility, to a production facility this year. So that's interesting to see how it's happening. We're actually running two businesses at the same time, an MRO facility that will keep going and continue to do upgrades and repairs and things like that to the existing fleet. And then we'll also intertwine in the production as the market's allowing us to seed it into the demand that's being created. There's been a tremendous amount of disparity, if you will, in certain segments of the market. Uh, the very high end, for some reason or another, they can't build them fast enough. And you would think that the entry level, especially with an economy struggling to recover from a couple of years of confusion at the very least, would be adapting and adopting these airplanes very quickly. What does this industry need to do at this point to communicate to potential new aircraft owners to people who need to use airplanes for business, that this is a segment that they need to be addressing. You know, I think the larger end of the market is just not sensitive to the current economy, and that's why it continues to run, and I think that's great. But we do have to show the typical business owner the great utility of being able to travel in the air from one location to another to make a deal happen in their particular business. I know NBAA promoted for many years, I don't see it as much this year, that great phrase from Warren Buffett, you know, it's very hard to see eye to eye if you're not face to face. I think we just have to continue to promote that because it is just hugely helpful to be able at a moment's notice to be working with a business counterpart to make a transaction happen. And I all too often hear from many of our customers, they make more money in their business than their cost of flying, and their business grows faster because of that ability to connect people together. You made a pitch uh, some time back for military applications for the airplane. Are they taking you seriously on this? Are we getting, making any headway to seeing an Eclipse someday in Air Force colors or the like? Yes, our country deserves to have the Eclipse flown as a military trainer. Just in the T-1A program alone, which there's 178 of the current beach jet 400s, we could save the military in just that one mission syllabus section about $12 billion over the next 10 years. So, and we're just talking fuel efficiency now. And, uh, and, and so, uh, yeah, I think the government is taking us serious. We're talking to a lot of people all throughout the Air Force. We're talking through a lot of congressional leaders as well, too. And we're getting a lot of support, but trying to coalesce, coalesce our government uh, into making change sometimes just uh, takes a little bit of time. But very, very good progress and we're excited about it. And, and that's just one of many military training programs the Eclipse would be applicable for. And finally, 2015 is right around the corner. What do you see for the airplane, the company, and your market? You know, 2015 is hopefully a great year for us. We're going to continue to produce planes as the market allows and bring them into the space. And we're going to continue to support our customers, improve the product, and uh, keep the Eclipse flying and, uh, and keeping it uh, the plane that it should be. Aero TV is brought to you by... Today's pilots must have power for electronic flight bags, tablets, iPads, and communication devices. The TA-102 dual USB charging port delivers more power with less hassles. Available from your local avionics dealer.